Hey guys, it's Tim from Tech Stuff. Today I'm going to show you in Leopard how you can adjust the look of the dock. Now, there's many different ways you can do this, but there's some very easy ways. So you now you can always go into the dock menu. You can make the size different, move the magnification, but I don't want to do that. Move it to the left, or to the bottom where I like it, or to the right, or to the bottom. But you really can't do much more than that. So there's a program called Doc Doctor, which you will be using. Go Google and type in Doc Doctor Doc Dr. And then here's the first one. Click on that. This is a free program. D click on download. It's downloading right here. It's taking a second because I'm direct I'm uploading YouTube videos right now, which I do all the time. By the way, I'm using my MacBook Pro, which is amazing. For instance, I'm in Final Cut Express, and I'm rendering out a giant video. I'm uploading videos to YouTube. I'm downloading software. I have tons of windows open. And while I'm doing that, I also am recording this live video. And right now, I'm just going through my settings. I just did a tutorial on Expose, and I'm seeing why this thing won't. Sorry, this is taking so long, guys. But anyway, this Doc Doctor program is the best program. It lets you modify your doc. So, once Doc Doctor is downloaded, it's going to come up and ask you when you want to install it. You continue. It's going to be like, yeah, okay. It'll be like, okay. Yeah, I want to install the software. Click on that. Install. Type in your little password. Doesn't take that long to install. And then... As soon as it's done installing itself, close it. Go to Spotlight by hitting Apple Spacebar or clicking it up there. Type in Doc. Hit Return. Here it is. You can make it a 2D Doc. Let's, see, let's say we want to do 2D. Now the Doc is just two-dimensional, not three. You can make the hidden applications up. See, you can do the icons like that or transparent, which is really cool looking. So you can change it down like that. You can disable the dashboard or not. Dock skins. If you, um, here, let's restart the dock. You can add different dock skins right there. Um, you can add a dock spacer, like to where it adds cool stuff. Like I said, the, there's the dock skins. Like, see, there's a spacer right there now. You got your little dock skins you can add. I'm not going to add those right now. Well, uh, adding spacers, and then if you don't want to do this anymore, you can restore the leopard defaults. It comes back like this. Now let's add some of the dock skins. Hmm. It, it doesn't want to let me do the duck skins today. But anyway, now the duck is back to normal the way I actually like it because I really don't want to change it. But for those of you that do, Doc Doctor, go to inter, intermindmedia.com and then you click on software and then there's Doc Doctor. Email me, comment, rate, subscribe, even if you hate it, I don't care. Bye.